But um, hey everybody, Last Outrider here with an exciting, personally exciting video for you. Nars of creation's soul. Children of the horned rat. The rat men are the most numerous of all of the children of chaos, amassing in unfathomable numbers in the bowels of creation. From Blight City, their hideous home that clings like a separating scab to the realm of chaos, the ratmen burrow and gnaw their way into the mortal realms. Billions team within Blight City's tunnels, and their numbers grow steadily. When the Skaven strike, they do so without warning. A tide of chittering beasts, a wall of rusting weapons, matted fur and scabrous flesh. With arcane weaponry, they blast their foes. For though the Skaven seem simple-minded, their warlock engineers possess the cunning to fashion some of the deadliest weapons ever witnessed in the mortal realms. Even as lightning cannons and warp fire throwers hurl searing death upon the foe, giant mutated abominations strike through their ranks, the hideous product of infernal breeding and blasphemous surgeries. Greatest among the Skaven kind are the vermin lords, mighty demons of the great horned rat, who not only ensure the rat god's wayward children don't wipe each other out in their interseen conflicts, but also lead them in their ever-creeping conquest. Inscrutable though the great horned rat's plan may be, the actions of his followers are felt across the mortal realms. In Gairan, vast legions of plague monks march alongside the diseased hordes of Bolathrax, united in their desire to eradicate the lush realm of life forever. And in Shaish, the Skaven clans battle constantly against the undead of Nagash. Rat ogres and storm fiends smashing death rattle legions asunder in the chill depths of the realm of death. Now that, for me, people, while being an extremely short introduction, is an extremely important one. First of all, for the first time in, I'm going to actually say 25 years, there's a new greater demon. The um, what vermin lords? Vermin lords have just been declared to be greater demons of the horned rat. That's pretty cool for me. In fact, this is an entirely new chaos power out there, which means it's also going to be appearing in 40k people now. Now. You can hold me accountable to this, but I believe they're going to be called the HRUD in 40K. HRUD, H-R-U-D. We've heard about them. I have no idea when they first appeared, but they've been around for decades. Um, <clears throat> they've been around since at least the Horus Heresy because they're mentioned in the in the in in that in that book series. One of the Perturbo, Perturbo, one of Perturbo's um, legion, I forget his name, was recruited by Dorn to help fortify the, the fortress of Terra. I don't know his name, but he was in one of the short stories. He, 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 even though his legion was traitor, he joined 
Dorn in 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 and fortifying Terra, and he was aged almost to dying. He was it was important because he showed that Space Marines are mortal. That somehow when a when a Hrud migration crossed his path, they aged him like freaking a thousand years in the space of a month. So that sounds pretty specific in, term, in terms of some form of power that they're going to manifest in 40k. But this is an entirely new chaos power here being introduced into the, into the Warhammer world, which is a huge event for anybody who's a follower of, of Warhammer fluff. If you just want to play competitively, you don't care. No point values here. But this is cool, and uh, so Skaven themselves then are chaos entities, okay? They're not a race, they're not a species, they didn't evolve, they don't come from a planetary or system, that, or they weren't mutated by warp stone falling down onto the planet of the, of the old world, which was a common you know, origin story from them uh, from before. They are themselves warp creatures. Uh, that's, for me, very, very interesting. Uh, it's, it's, it, it adds a lot of imaginative possibilities, for me, at least, in, the, in, my, in my view of the 40K universe. And I hope a lot of you enjoy that as well. So until next time, <laughs> bye. Mm.